Have you ever gazed up at the night sky and wondered what lies at the heart of our Milky Way? In the grand theater of the cosmos, our galaxy, the Milky Way, plays a starring role. It's an elegant spinning pinwheel of stars, gas, dust, and dark matter, spanning a hundred thousand light years across. Yet, at its core, at the very heart of this celestial marvel, lies a region shrouded in mystery, the galactic center. Imagine the Milky Way as a city, vast and bustling with stars as its citizens. These celestial bodies aren't randomly scattered. They're organized into distinct neighborhoods, or arms, spiraling out from the city center. But it's the downtown, the galactic center, that holds our interest. It's a place of intrigue, teeming with dense clusters of stars and cloaked by thick dust clouds. This galactic center is a maze, a challenging terrain for astronomers. The density of stars and the dust clouds make it difficult to peer into, almost like trying to spot a single grain of sand in a swirling dust storm. But these challenges do not deter us. They only fuel our curiosity. As we venture further into the depths of our galaxy, we realize that the galactic center is far from quiet. It's a bustling hub, a cosmic crossroads where stars are born and die, where matter gets crushed into oblivion, and where colossal energies are unleashed. The galactic center is our gateway to understanding the Milky Way. It's like the beating heart of our galaxy, pulsating with mysteries and secrets. It's a place where the ordinary laws of physics are stretched to their limits, where the incredible and the bizarre become the norm. So, as we stand under the night sky, gazing up at the twinkling stars, let's remember that we're looking at just the surface of an infinite cosmic ocean. Beneath its serene facade, the Milky Way hides a world of mysteries waiting to be unraveled. Indeed, the galactic center is a beacon of mystery, waiting for us to unveil its secrets. Imagine embarking on a journey, not in miles or kilometers, but in light years. In the realm of cosmic exploration, we don't just count distance in miles or kilometers. We use a much grander scale, light years. A light year is the distance that light, moving at a staggering speed of about 186,000 miles per second, travels in one year. To put it in perspective, light can travel around the Earth more than seven times in just one second. Now let's set our sights on the galactic center, the heart of our Milky Way galaxy. It's an astronomical distance away, approximately 26,000 light years. If you're finding it hard to comprehend how far that is, don't worry, you're not alone. These are distances on a scale that is truly mind-boggling. Consider this, if we could travel at the speed of light, it would still take us 26,000 years to reach the galactic center. That's longer than the entire span of recorded human history. And the light we see from the galactic center today, it began its journey to us 26,000 years ago, when our ancestors were painting on cave walls. The speed of light also gives us a unique window into the past. When we look deep into space, we're essentially looking back in time. The further away an object is, the longer its light has taken to reach us, and the older the image we see. This journey in light years isn't just about distance, it's about time. It's a voyage across the cosmos that simultaneously takes us back through the ages. Every look into the stars is a glimpse into the past, a silent witness to the history of our universe unfolding. Light years, then, are not just measures of distance. They're markers of the universe's history, a cosmic clock ticking away the eons. It's a journey that truly puts into perspective the vastness of our universe. At the heart of our galaxy lies a monstrous entity, a supermassive black hole known as Sagittarius A asterisk. This celestial beast is not your average black hole. It's supermassive, tipping the cosmic scales at about four million times the mass of our sun. It sits at the very center of our galaxy, about 26,000 light years away from Earth. But don't worry, we're in no danger of getting sucked in. The sheer scale of space keeps us at a safe distance. Now you might be wondering, what exactly is a black hole? Well, imagine a star much larger than our sun collapsing under its own gravity. This collapse creates a point in space with such strong gravitational pull that nothing, not even light, can escape it. Hence the term black hole. It's like an invisible cosmic vacuum cleaner, but instead of dust, it swallows stars and gas. But how do we detect something that's essentially invisible? The answer lies in its interaction with nearby matter, stars near Sagittarius. A asterisk behave differently, orbiting at high speeds due to the immense gravitational pull. By observing these stars, astronomers can infer the presence and mass of the black hole. Black holes aren't just fascinating objects, they play a crucial role in galaxy formation. Think of them as cosmic anchors, their enormous gravitational pull helping to hold galaxies together. Without Sagittarius A asterisk, our Milky Way might not exist as we know it. But don't let their destructive reputation fool you. While black holes do devour nearby matter, they also spew out jets of particles at nearly the speed of light. This process, called feedback, 
can trigger the birth of new stars, contributing to the life cycle of the galaxy. Sagittarius A asterisk is truly the king of our galaxy, holding everything in its powerful gravitational grip. Yet despite its dominance, it remains shrouded in mystery, a cosmic enigma at the heart of our home in the universe. A surrounding the black hole is a bustling hub of cosmic activity, the galactic bulge. The galactic bulge, as the name implies, is a dense, elliptical structure situated at the very heart of our Milky Way. This cosmic hub is a melting pot of stars, gas, and dust, all swirling together in a dance choreographed by gravity. The stars here are older, their age is measured in billions of years, their light a testament to the longevity of our universe. They're densely packed, a testament to the immense gravitational forces at play. In fact, the concentration of stars in the galactic bulge is so high that the night sky from a planet located there would be perpetually illuminated by a symphony of starlight. But the galactic bulge is not just a retirement home for ancient stars. It's also a stellar nursery, a place where new stars are born. The gas and dust that permeate the bulge provide the raw materials for star formation. Under the influence of gravity, these materials coalesce, becoming denser and hotter, until a new star ignites, casting its light into the cosmos. This region also hosts high-energy phenomena that are nothing short of celestial fireworks. Supernovae, the explosive deaths of massive stars, light up the galactic bulge, their brightness momentarily rivaling that of entire galaxies. These stellar explosions disperse heavy elements into space, seeding the cosmos with the building blocks for new stars, planets, and perhaps even life. And then there are the gamma ray bursts, the most energetic events in the universe. When a massive star collapses into a black hole or neutron star, it can unleash a torrent of gamma rays, producing a flash of light so brilliant it can be detected billions of light years away. The galactic bulge is a place of extremes, of ancient stars and new beginnings, of serene beauty and violent eruptions. It's a testament to the dynamic, ever-changing nature of our universe. The galactic bulge, a cradle of starbirth and a stage for cosmic fireworks. Our journey to the galactic center is just the beginning. As we peer into the heart of our galaxy, we stand on the precipice of a new era of space exploration. The tools and technologies we're developing today will allow us to delve deeper into the Milky Way than ever before charting a new course for humanity among the stars. Imagine a future where we can send probes to the galactic center, capable of capturing high-resolution images and collecting invaluable data that will expand our understanding of the universe. These missions will not only offer us a closer look at the supermassive black hole, Sagittarius A asterisk, but also provide insights into the formation and evolution of galaxies. In addition to probes, we're also looking at the potential of telescopes, with even greater power and precision than we currently possess. These instruments will allow us to observe in unprecedented detail the stellar nursery and the galactic bulge, areas teeming with activity and ripe for exploration. Yet, it's not just about the technology. It's about the potential discoveries that these missions could lead to. We might find new celestial bodies, witness phenomena that defy our current understanding of physics, or even stumble upon signs of extraterrestrial life. The possibilities are as vast as the universe itself. Moreover, these missions and discoveries could revolutionize our understanding of the universe. They could provide answers to some of the most fundamental questions we have about our existence. How did the universe begin? How does it work? Are we alone? At the same time, they could also raise new questions, fueling our curiosity and driving us to push the boundaries of our knowledge even further. In this way, Every mission, every discovery, is a stepping stone on the path to greater understanding. Our journey to the galactic center is not a destination, but an ongoing voyage of discovery and exploration. It's a testament to our inherent curiosity, our desire to understand our place in the universe, and our determination to push the boundaries of what we know. As we continue our cosmic journey, who knows what mysteries we will uncover next in the heart of our galaxy.